Hey everybody and welcome back. In this video I'm just going to show you really really quickly how to add a couple of cool effects to your renders to just add a little bit of realism to them. So I'm actually using an image from a game that I'm currently working on and this is going to be a super easy thing. So if you're interested in supporting the channel feel free to visit the Patreon in the description down below or become a member of the channel. Of course all my patrons will get a shout out at the end of the video and everybody else you're just awesome for hitting subscribe and all that jazz so let's jump into this then it's not going to take long honestly so we're on our our image is loaded and this is straight out of dust studio so as you can see i've done as much in the sort of rendering stage that i can do now i'm going to just hit Control and j to duplicate my layer then i'm going to go to image adjustments and i'm going to come down and i'm going to find threshold which is just here as you can see it's done some wacky stuff what i'm going to do is i'm going to drag up this slider until such point as there's minimal light on the actual figure that's lit there's still a little bit in the coffee cup there that i'm not overly keen on so i'm just going to drag that up a little bit further there we go that's what i'm after i'm going to hit ok then I'm going to change this layers screen mode to screen like so and what you're going to see is apparently nothing gone on. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go to filter, blur, Gaussian blur and then I can adjust the amount of blur as much as I want to just give me a bit of a realistic kind of bloom effect which just adds a bit of realism to the image. Now I'm going to create a new layer just hitting this button down here and I'm going to select red and I'm just going to go across there then I'm going to hit green and I'm going to put that next to it and then I'm going to go with blue and I'm going to put that next to there and then all I'm going to do is just drag down the opacity of this until it's barely noticeable like so and then all you've got is uh, some cool light effects there so that's really all there is to it I hope you found that useful if not very very brief let me know what you think in the comments below. I will see you in the next video. But until then, you take damn good care of yourself, guys, alright? Bye-bye.